Neutron Tacondos, Monza, 36 Zora, The Saint, The Forest Hill, and Galleria on the Park. This is Yossi Kaplan, Toronto Realtor and Mortgage Broker, and today we're going to review some of the most beautiful fall 2019's new Toronto Condos launches, Monza, Zora, Saint, Forest Hill, and Galleria on the Park. I also got the assignment to show at 48 University, a couple other treats. All right, this is Yossi Kaplan, Toronto Real Estate Agent, Mortgage Broker. Here's my Twitter, twitter.com slash Yossi Kaplan. If you want to follow me, uh, go here and you'll get all the assignments that are not fit to print, everything we cannot put on the blog, and anything else that needs to be here comes in uh, Twitter. Every piece of information I have, whether from every website or new listings or whatever goes in the Twitter, so that's a really good place to follow. Looks like a little stuck right now, but here we go. Okay, it's coming back. Okay, very good. Um, before we start, six, uh, unit 618 and 36 Lisgar, the price is 469. Uh, we estimate the cash flow to be 26,400. This is a two bedroom investment unit that is for sale on MLS for 469. It's currently the cheapest two bedroom available in the building. It's also the one of the only ones with nine foot ceilings. It's a lovely unit and I think whoever is gonna get it is gonna have a great time uh, either living there or making money on the rents. Uh, the condo fees are low, 432. The tax is about 145 a month. The carrying cost total is about 640 before mortgage if you have any. That means that your cash flow could be about 1550 a month, give or take. Probably bring it up to 1600. Um, depending on, on uh, your finances there and, and the final numbers. But you're looking at you know uh, $26,000 a year, that's not bad for after your fixed costs. Very, very good, okay? So that's, if you want that, go to yossi.searchrealty.co, link below, or give me a shout if it's still available, I'll show you how to do it. Um, it's a rare unit, not a lot come this way, so you know once I have it, I have it. Uh, here's the listing for Lisgar. It's right here, and that's the listing for the unit I just showed you the flyer for. It's a really nice unit. Works really well. Everything is good, and uh, I think it's a very good investment property. Uh, moving on to 488 University, we have this is this is a, this is a occupancy just started. We're gonna get the keys for this one in about a month time in October. This unit is fantastic. Unit offered at less than 1,200 a foot at 649.5. 488 University, direct to the subway, 39th floor, south view, one bedroom. I think this will rent to an executive for about 5,000 a month, say a surgeon that is coming to train in Mount Sinai for six or 12 months. They easily, you know, these guys make a million dollars a year, or ladies, I say guys, all the genders, plurals. Um, Pause it required about 95,000, uh, one uh, on closing, 25,000, and the rest is yours, okay? So that, that's also a very good option for you. If you're taking 5,000 uh, a month, uh, you know, your carrying costs, it won't be much. Uh, uh, the fixed cost, you know, condo fees, uh, we don't have them yet, but it'll be like uh, 400 bucks something, and the tax about 200. You know, it's gonna be about a buck a foot, so you're looking at about $600 a foot, $600 for the unit for month. Um, your income is about 5,000. Even if you spend, you know, <laughs> a bit more, you're still looking about, you know, possible a four thousand uh, dollar income a month here, forty eight thousand a year income uh, before mortgage. That's crazy. Okay, so that's a very good investment. If you know what I'm talking about, you do. <laughs> if you don't do the homework and learn how it works, but the numbers are right here. Okay, if you want more, just call me. I'll, I'll explain to you. I'll tell you how it works. No problem. Okay. Uh, moving to Monza here, and in the Monza, um, I'm looking here at some of the renderings for Monza. This is a new building coming out in the West End. It's really, really lovely. Um, I really like the design. It's kind of unique. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Everyone starts coughing here. Uh, I love the renders. I think that the marketing job they did is really, really nice, and I have uh, high expectations. Uh, note all these, all these are enclosed balconies. Uh, if you like it, it's cool. If you don't like it, it's still an enclosed balcony. Uh, however, because the floor above you is smaller, you'll have some of a, some of it open. You know, when you close to the edge, it'll be open. But if you come in, it'll be enclosed. So that's interesting. I mean, you will get some rain and uh, snow on your balcony here, so it'll be like kind of half open, half closed. Uh, obviously, there's more room in the bottom floor, so I expect to see larger units or larger balconies. And as they come here, there'll be less unit per floor. Uh, more expensive, of course, as you come up the building. Very nice. I haven't seen the floor plans yet. They'll probably release uh, next week, but the basics are here. Okay, so that's very, very good. Uh, it looks really, really nice. I really like it. Uh, stay tuned, and you'll be able to register through me for the Monza. Okay, next we're looking at the Saint. The Saint is a Minto. Uh, also coming uh, West End-ish. Uh, they got, uh, oh, sorry, the Saint. I'm uh, missing here. The Saint is a church in uh, Adelaide, 47 stories. 
Okay, I, I move my tabs around, so I, I already memorized the tabs. Uh, but they got a little video for it, and basically looking at the tower, right in the financial district. If you need to uh, be by Union Station, if you need to be the financial district, that's where you go. Uh, let me see what's going on with the internet. I'm going to open another window that you cannot see here. Okay, this is all live, by the way. Maybe you can see this, maybe not. Here we go, connect to the internet. Okay, I'm connected, and let's run this window again. Magic. <laughs> all right. So here's the saying, that's the video, that's the video from the developer, Minto, you know, Minto, uh, King West here, Minto, 78 to come see, Minto is everywhere. So they got some nice mixed video. <clears throat> so here's the building. Okay, church in Adelaide, so the saying, because all the churches there, kind of play on words. Okay, uh, very nice marketing. I don't know if it's required or just, just give me the, me, just give me the building, show me what you saw me, I mean, that, that, but that's okay. Uh, but if you look here, we'll just uh, pause here for a second. Got all these things out. There we go. So you can see it's it's a big, bright building uh, coming up here. Uh, there's quite a few buildings in the area. More are going to come. But the location, is fantastic church in Adelaide. It's about, it, it, basically, they're telling me, they're telling you, it's it's uh, King and Young. So if you're an executive, um, you know, if, if, if you want that area just east of Young, but still in the financial district, there's really not a lot of choice. There's the L Tower, of course, there's Backstage, there's a couple of the older buildings there, but you know, the finishes are not that great. Uh, there are a couple of new ones, but not that much. There's really not a lot in that specific area. However, church <clears throat> all the way up is gonna be completely built, and then east of it, Jarvis, all the way up will be completely built. So pay attention here. Um, you know, if you grab a unit here for a thousand a foot or twelve hundred a foot, it's very, very good value, in my opinion, because wherever you look, it's already over that. Um, I doubt there'll be a thousand a foot, probably twelve to fifteen here. Okay, so that's the Saint uh, by Minto. They'll, they'll, you'll be able to register for each of these condos, uh, whether it's uh, the resale for thirty-six Lisgar, just contact me directly on the page. Forty-eight University, just contact me directly. Um, Monza, you can do it on the website of my website. I'll post that for you. The Saint on my website and the Forest Hill. There's another building coming. There's so many of them coming. This is like the biggest time of year, so I gotta like put fire with them in a, a video. Uh, but this is coming to um, to Forest Hill. That's at Bathurst and Eglinton. Uh, studios from 300s, one beds from the fours, one plus them from the fives, and two beds from the six. We've had a few condos in the Forest Hill area <clears throat> along these Sinclair Eglinton. And they tend to sell overnight. They tend to sell very quickly. Um, a lot of people, they see the value, they understand the area, just go for them. A lot of people focus on downtown, kind of forget that Toronto is not just downtown. There's actually a lot more. Um, if you can get an investment here, <coughs> the ice crusher, the background, if you can hear it. Uh, if you can uh, grab an investment here. Now, I remember when we started launching um, uh, the Freed buildings, 150 and 155 Red Path, uh, they came in 600 bucks a foot. Now they're 1,000 to 1,200 a foot, and people are like, complaining about it. I said, look, it's probably going to double its value by the time you get your keys. And they did. They have, um, so, you know, you could have bought 150, 155 Red Path for 600 a foot and do it really, really well. You know, you'd pay uh, for 1,000 square, uh, square foot unit, 600,000, give or take, and now it's probably over a million dollars. You'd pay in a 300, I think two bedrooms uh, when we sold there, uh, two bedrooms corner units were 399. I remember there's some units were 399 for two bedrooms. Okay, these units are now 799, 899. And don't forget, you only paid 20% of that, so you paid you know, on the $400,000 unit, you only paid uh, $80,000. But now, if the value is $800,000, you literally 10x your money. You only put 80, 80 down. When you sell it, you get the whole 800 in your pocket. Of course, less the, less the, um, the mortgage if you have any. If you had no mortgage, you made four hundred thousand dollars plus your eighty for eighty. If you had some mortgage, you'll make the four hundred the difference, um, less the mortgage plus the eighty. Okay, that's how we calculate. So that's the Forest Hill. Um, don't neglect these areas. Uh, some of the buildings that were built in that area were really good, like 150, 155, 101 Erskine. You know, all these buildings are really good. Some of them were not that great, were not that successful. Um, the reason those not successful because they're shitty floor plans. Keep my language, but the floor plan is really atrocious. 
And then, then the investors that don't understand floor plan, they buy these units. But well, once you walk into the unit, you see it, you know, it doesn't look that great. Um, and that's a problem then because you cannot maximize your value. That's why call me and I'll go through the floor plans with you. And I've been doing it for so many years. And I'll tell you how to do it. Okay. Um, 36 Zora. That's a really interesting building. Um, the reason this is interesting is because they claim to have some uh, Airbnb built in the building. I've made a video about 36 Zora. Now, their marketing is off the hook. I mean, it's really cool and fantastic. And show all these young people and like their lifestyle and the white. Really, really nice. <laughs> that's really good. Uh, but, you know, that's not real life. These are models. Uh, but we'll see. Again, I think uh, in about a week or two, the price will come up. You can register for 36 Zora already on my site. And the link is below. And um, if this building indeed will have some good Airbnb, then we'll see. Um, you know, we had one in Niagara. Uh, two buildings are sold right away. If you uh, search for Yossi Kaplan Niagara Airbnb, you'll find the video. And I'll put the link below if you like. Um, and that sold out with no advertising, nothing. A third building will come in Niagara. This is a different animal here because Zora is, uh, is uh, more of West End. So it's a whole other style. It's a very nice 50s kind of style. So that's Zora, okay? 36 Zora. Um, moving on to Gallery on the Park. Gallery on the Park, you know, was, was the biggest uh, biggest talk of, of last month, of course. Uh, I made a big uh, video of this month, September. Uh, the VIP sale, it's still on. You can still send your worksheets in. Uh, the price are fantastic. They started $9.65 a foot. So that's really, really good. You know, BIG King West, $1,600, $1,700 for a regular um, unit and $2,000 a foot for the penthouse. This is $9.65, less than half of the penthouse. And I think amazing... Uh, amazing opportunity here for the investors but you got to take action and you got to do it okay when you go to YouTube uh, if you want to learn more do this go to YouTube there's this go to your youtube.com slash Yossi Kaplan and you're gonna get the videos here and all these videos I've been preparing and I've uploaded uh, well over 100 videos just the last year um, and, you know they're all live thank you very much for the subscribers by the way really really helpful I'm really really excited about that uh, so all the videos will be here. You know, it's super slow today, but that's okay. Um, how to buy a construction condo, Galleria, selling condo privately, pricing your condo. A lot of the issues that, that people are facing uh, when it comes to condos, I, I try to address it here, okay? Um, real estate market fall, I explain it. I explain about the rentals. I explain about other areas of Titron. I explain about million-dollar condos, how to find assignments, on and on and on. There's so many topics here. There's no place to learn about Toronto real estate. Um, unless you just do it and learn from experience, you know, lawyers don't learn that at school, realtors don't learn that at school, nobody knows these things unless you just start to do it yourself. So, you know, a developer comes, they're not born with this knowledge, there's no school for it. I mean, there is, but it's all theoretical. But no one actually tells you how it works. So, if you go on these videos and watch these videos, and God knows I put a lot of videos here, a lot of effort into these videos, but hopefully it'll educate the market and you'll see what's going on. And also, we can have a relationship starting with you watching my videos realizing you know, he's a good guy, he knows what he's saying, and you come and buy with me because that's what I do. I'm a real estate agent and a mortgage broker. So the process goes like this. When you want to get a pre-construction uh, condo, for example, any other condo, you get in touch with me. Uh, once you get in touch with me, we'll talk. We'll see like what you're trying to get, what's your unique situation, your first time buyer, an investor, you have a place to sell, you're not selling, you move into the city, you're already in the city, it's for yourself, it's for someone else, it's for a renter. You know, so many options. It's, like never, it's never the same. And then together... We'll work out a plan to find the perfect investment for you, okay? Now, if you're looking to sell, it's a bit easier because you're going to tell me what your unit is. I'm going to do the comps. I'm going to look at the, at, at the numbers. Basically, tell you um, what's the best thing for you to do, um, how much I think you'll get, and I'm usually on the money, and how long it's going to take to sell. And my strength is, of course, in marketing, where I market units. I've broken sales record in so many buildings. Um, the recent unit I did a King, King and Bathurst, King West. I broke every sale record in the building, whether it's the square footage, with the type of unit, like you name it. Like I break every sale record. But that's because of meticulous uh, preparation, because we know the market, we understand it, we do all the numbers, you know, I'm very, very straight up kind of guy and kind of person. So when someone comes to me, I give you the information straight up. I will never pressure you to buy or sell, but I will tell you this is a good opportunity. You should probably pull the trigger now. Um, and I used to be right on these things, okay? So that's good. Um, if you need more information, uh, you can go to my Twitter. I also uh, keep a page on, uh, on Facebook, facebook.com slash Urban Realty Toronto, which all this information is also been posted to. Um, the most information you probably get on the Twitter, and then you can go to my sites, uh, eocaplan.com, 
this is a site where I post uh, assignments, I post uh, new condos, uh, the videos get posted automatically. There we go. Okay, so anything you need, just come here. If you want to learn about 36 Zero and Airbnb investing, you come here. If you want to learn about other things like cash flow investments, why prices are going up, Toronto townhouses, how to invest, it's all here. Um, another website that I keep is urbanrealtytoronto.com. That's kind of my main website for many, many years, and that site will tell you about everything you need to know about real estate. Um, you can go 10 years back here. Some of these posts are not that great, but you know, it is what it is. Um, just put it up and move on. So gallery on the park here, Toronto three best investors, one cross town, eight secrets, and so on and so forth. Okay, all these are available to you here. Um, if you want to look at over a million dollar properties, Yorkville, Luxury, realestate.com. That's also my site. I keep a lot of sites, my friends, a lot of information out there, and I try to make as much information as I can provided for you for free so you can make better investments and make them with me because I'll help you make the best decision possible. Okay, so here we go. More information, more assignments, more condos for sale. These are more uptown, Yorkville, over a million, so on and so forth. Okay. So that, there you go. Um, you can buy a castle property here and make $100,000 every four years. This is the one, okay? I think this one will make you about 50,000 in rents a year. That, that's, my, uh, that's my understanding here. And I'm happy to talk to any investor that want more information about this because that's really important. Um, in Monza, I think what you're gonna get here is you're gonna get a very, very nice product and maybe slightly uh, cheaper than downtown because it's a bit of a West End, uh, the Saint. It's going to be probably a more of a fuller price kind of, kind of condo. Um, and I have all these prices in about a week or two. They're all coming out now. The same will be very, very nice for a solid, you know, financial uh, district east investment with a very good company, Minto, of course. Uh, the Forest Hill coming to you. That's going to be a very good address. I think this is one of my, like, my focuses here, the Forest Hill. I think that's going to be really, really good. I really love the location. You're not company with downtown. Center Court, uh, Andrew, amazing people there. Okay, they're doing great work. Uh, 36 Zora. Maybe here. 36 Zora is the Airbnb building. We'll see what they come up with. We'll see if they make it work. I'm really curious to see what kind of numbers they'll come up with and how they do it. Uh, that's uh, also West End. Galleria, DuPont and Dufferin. We discussed that extensively. Galleria, get in there. If you still want, get in there. I would buy two bedroom corner units on high floors here if you can. Because I think that's that's a really scarce product, and with this price, you know, like when you see a really really good price on a high quality product, you buy it. You know, I can go to Dollarama every day and buy the cheap stuff every day, but when the new good stuff comes out and it's it's half price comparing to others, I go for it. Okay, this is the YouTube.com/slash Yossi Kaplan. I give you all the information you need to know about real estate. There's nowhere else to learn it. YossiKaplan.com, all the information you want about real estate. UrbanRealtyToronto.com, market reports, Toronto real estate market, condos for sale, investment focus, and Yorkville luxury real estate, over a million assignments, Yorkville and north of the downtown. That's it.